Hi there, my name is CM Manjunath. In this video, I'm going to show you how to whitelist your WP forms. If you have WP forms on your WordPress website, when the visitors fill out these details and it reaches your Gmail spam folder, I'm going to help you get those mails straight to your inbox instead. Okay, so that's the problem you're going to fix in this video. Let's get started. Let's see what the step number one is going to be. For this, we have to navigate to the form. And for that, we need to go to the dashboard, WordPress dashboard, forms, check for that specific form, and we are going to click on the edit link. Dashboard, on the left side, go to WP forms, all forms. And then we are going to pick up the one form that matters to us. So in order to do that, I use Elementor on my website. Let's say this is the first form. I'll click on the edit WP forms right here and I'll get to the name of the form. Here it is simple contact form. Go back in here, simple contact form, click on the edit link. Okay. Now, Let's move on to step number two. The step number two is to get the subject line. How to do that? Well, you just need to go to the settings, notifications and get the subject line. Here's how to do it. On the left side, go to settings and then notifications. Here, the second field in this list is email subject. I'm going to copy that. Right click, copy, go to the notepad, paste it in. Okay, make sure there is no extra space. It's very important that there is no extra space. Now we are going to move on to step number three. Very, very simple indeed. We, we are going to switch to Gmail and we are going to tweak the settings a little bit. We are going to create a new filter and paste this subject line. Just go into your Gmail account, click on this cog right here, click on all the settings. There are different tabs, general, labels, inbox, accounts, and filters and blocked addresses. I'm going to click on the fifth one, filters and blocked addresses. And right here, I see a link that says create a new filter. You just need to click on this, create new filter. And the third field is subject, select, paste it. Like I told you, be very diligent about not having that extra space right here. All right, and then we are going to click on this create filter. There is one last step, which is to ensure that we check never send it to spam okay there's a checkbox where we have to check this never send it to spam so i did and click create filter now that's all it takes for your wp forms to not go into the spam folder instead directly get into your inbox all right i hope you found this useful if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to this channel for more digital marketing knowledge. This is CM Manjunath signing off. Good luck and God bless.